Hello there. For the second Friday in a row, some of us have experienced some extreme heat drifting up from the near continent. In fact, the first Friday of August saw temperatures peaking at 36.4 degrees in central London, and the heat was pretty widespread across the Midlands, central and southern England, widely seeing those temperatures in excess of 30 degrees. That said, not for all. In parts of northwest Wales and the Outer Hebrides, we saw temperatures only at around 16 or 17 degrees, and here there were some showery outbreaks of rain. So over the next few hours, those temperatures will fall into single figures. By contrast, in the southeast, it's going to be a very uncomfortable night for getting a good night's sleep. We wake up on Saturday morning, perhaps low to mid-twenties. So that means plenty of sunshine around, albeit hazy for the weekend. We keep the heat in the southeast with some very warm nights to come, much fresher in the far northwest. That's because we're under this influence of high pressure, but there is a weak weather front slicing across the high. Now, this is just a band of cloud, really, maybe the odd spot of uh, light drizzle, but it's the dividing line between the fresher air up into the northwest and circulating around that high as a northeasterly breeze. That'll just make it feel a little more comfortable, perhaps, along those exposed east coasts. At the same time, after that warm, sultry start, the temperatures in the south are set to climb once again. So widely, we're going to see mid to high 20s, possibly into the mid 30s once again. Further north and west, that's where temperatures should be really for the time of year, 17 to 22 degrees. That weather front could spark a few showers through the night, but generally speaking, it'll be a quiet night and quiet start to Sunday morning yet again. Again, it's going to be another uncomfortable night down into the south with low 20s to greet us first thing on Sunday morning. We could see a few isolated showers here and there across eastern England on Sunday, but generally this weekend it's with a dry story with some hazy sunshine coming through. Again, that northeasterly breeze just peppering the feel of the temperatures really across that east coast. Highest values on Sunday afternoon of 32 degrees. Now that heat is set to stay with us and it could, as we go into next week, trigger off the risk of some sharp and thundery downpours. That's it. Have a great weekend.